Hello Sagittarius, welcome to Robin's Realm Readings. I love you very much. Thank you so much for being here. This is a quick look at the uh, energies of the one that you are connected to. Um, thank you so much for the liking of my videos. So, those of you who are subscribed, welcome back. You know I love you. We're going on a very high vibration today and we're not letting anything stop us. Mm. Okay, too many cards came out. I'm looking at the energies for you at this time until the end of, uh, at least for the most part, till the end of the month, okay? Mercury retrograde has slowed down a whole lot of things. Okay, so the energy over your reading is of someone making an offer to someone and being extremely sincere about it, Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. Yes, they are. Let me shuffle these cards for you, Sagittarius. Someone rising Venus, North Node. Cross watchers are welcome. My readings are not gender specific. They are for whoever you love. Uh, wow. And I'm a little wonky today. Actually, I just woke up. Um, all right, here we go, my dears. So, have you been over to my store and, and bought some of my, my beautiful sacred mist? Uh, oh my gosh, you really should try it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Goodness. <clears throat> Sagittarius, someone rising Venus. Let's see what we have for you, honeys. Okay, just a second. I am calling upon Archangel Michael, the Archangel Uriel, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Raziel, Archangel Raguel, Archangel Sandalfin, and Archangel Metatron to completely surround and anoint this reading, protecting it from negative energies, blessing those that deserve to hear it. We need some good news. All right, let's take a look. <clears throat> Sagittarius, how are you showing up right now? So the energy for you is really good. Looks like a love offer. I'm going to move my camera a minute. Sorry. There you go. Okay. Sagittarius, how are you showing up right now in this love situation? Working hard on it. Putting everything you have into it. Focusing really hard on this destiny of yours. You could also be working on the bag right now. What else is going on? There is someone here, though, that's in conflict. They're trying to one-up you. They're trying to get ahead of you. They're trying to gossip about you. Um, and you know this is happening. It's like, uh, I'm working hard. They're trying to get you in a state of distress, worry, and fear. But you're working, working very hard. Tell me who this person is who's working against Sagittarius. We thought it was going to be a love offer, but we know that if there is a love offer, that someone may be jealous. Someone may be acting up in the background. You know what I mean? Sorry, my ear is itching all of a sudden. I don't like that much. One moment. Okay. I got to clear up the space. I got feel so crowded. Um, all right, Sag. We're going to find out. Let's find out who your love partner is, the one that, that you're really thinking of at this time first. Then we'll look at who that who that treacherous individual or spirit is that's bothering you. Remind, remember that the unity prayer of protection is a Reiki prayer. I'm a Reiki master, so I will use it. The light of God surrounds you. The love of God enfolds you. The power of God protects you. And the presence of God watches over you. We have a Cancer or a Pisces on the table. All right. So it looks like a Cancer or a Pisces here. That could be a Cancer or a Pisces right there as well. So they may be the one that's coming forward with love for you. Show us uh, what this Cancer or Pisces person, clarify it. I know who this is now. They just showed me who it is. The devil in reverse, the empress in reverse. It's someone that you know um, that is gossiping about you, backstabbing you. Um, it could be a an Aries um, or a Capricorn. Feminine, perhaps, in your experience, is giving you grief while you're working hard. Maybe stealing your content. Maybe trying to keep you away from your person. Pissed off that you met this person. Pissed off that you're happy. I'm pissed off that they're pissed off. It's none of their damn business. But let's see what's going on. Spirit, Holy Spirit. 
Tell me about this Cancer of Pisces, please. Ooh. They're sending messages. They're flirting with you. Someone's flirting with you? Are they sincere? It's a Pisces for sure. They're watching. They're, their hands are tied because maybe you do have a baby mama or somebody in the scene. Um, let me see the energy between you. Why is this person to find out? Why are they in a hangman state? Because they are indeed someone very important in your life. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. They are indeed someone important. And therefore, they're chilling until they know the coast is clear to come forward to you. First, this here, this bitchy, bitchy, um, devilish, you're mine, I'm addicted to you kind of shit is out the door. You're not putting up with that, my Sagis. What's the energy between you and this loved one over here, that, ha that king of cups? It is the world in reverse, not allowing anything to end the relationship. This is a change in uh, a dynamic change, you know, all the way around. But bursting through to a whole new experience, it hasn't been able to happen yet. Why? Because someone's guarding things. Someone's got their, um, either they're in a state of protection or they're protecting their energy, probably from this. That person's not working with you. They're not creating with you. They didn't work on the relationship. They hassled you. They gave you, they backstabbed you, compared you to everyone else, male or female. They kept you in a state of anxiety. And all you were doing was working on the relationship. Now you have this Pisces or Cancer over here. I see Pisces really, really intense. And the energy between you and the Pisces. Okay, so... You need to expect a message pretty soon. Someone might come in and just kind of really lay it on you real quick. But guess what? This is a good message you've been waiting for. Maybe you filed for divorce. Maybe you left someone. Maybe someone. Um, I'm not sure. But this is absolute rebirth. This is new love. This is vibrating in a healthy relationship. Vibrating at a higher vibration. Let's see what's going on with the uh, romance angels for you. Just a real quickie to tap into my Sagis. You're freeing yourself from this negative entity over here. This one that's draining you dry and com complaining and backstabbing and comparing you to someone else. And they want you to give the relationship a second chance. But you know how damaging they are. Very damaging, very toxic, very toxic. You're leaving something very toxic. And you're making the effort to, first of all, great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So it's very possible you're moving into a great love situation or away from a very icky one. Hmm? Yeah, now this relationship or the, the last one is a past life relationship. So what I'm going to do is ask them. Which relationship is a past life relationship? The new one or the old one? Show me. Give me a clue. The new one. The new one. Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. That is your past life relationship. Now you know. Um, wait a minute. Because this is um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is Aries, Taurus, Virgo, and the devil is Cap Capricorn. That person tried so hard to not show their ugly side, but they did. And you got tired of it. You couldn't take it anymore. You were always in a state of anxiety, always in a fear of what's going to happen next. And it doesn't matter whether they want to give the relationship a chance or not. You're like, no, no. I'm moving away quietly. I'm out. I'm out. What's Whatever happens here with your person here, this new love interest, uh, that would require a private reading. 
to see how your personal circumstances are, and I'm happy to offer those. I am available. Best to get it off either my Etsy shop or my website. And that's all in the box below. This person over here, what do they what do they want to say? Show me spirit. What's their message to Sagittarius? Well, that explains itself. I'm broken inside. How can I love you when I don't love myself? I heard. They're troubling. This makes sense with this conflicted energy, mental energy and verbs. I made a promise to someone to leave you alone, but I don't know if I can. That sounds like harassment because if it's done, it's done, right? Make sure it's done. They're having a very hell of a time. I can't picture you with anyone else but me. I hope it's not too late. Uh, it is too late. Mm. How about this new person that you're meeting? Is there something they don't tell you? What are their thoughts? What's their situation? They are set in their ways. That's not something you 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 know you sh you should be uh, ignoring. In other words, you'll never be able to change them. Good, very very good. It took me a long time, but I'm starting to not care about what other others think anymore. Good. Now you might actually be happy, honey. Now you might actually be happy. All right, sweethearts. Again, to carry forward, um, I thank you very much for your love and gifts. Thank you very much for the kindness you show my channel. Hitting that like button so another Sagittarius that might be in this predicament will know that there's hope. That's what it's about. That's why we ask you to hit the like button. It isn't all about money because we never, ever make enough to make it worth our time. Only you make it worth our time. So we appreciate you. We love you. And we thank you. And uh, don't forget to go to my store and get some of this amazing, my label's wonky, but don't forget to get this amazing sacred mist created for holiness. To When you're in prayer, meditation, perfect, perfect, perfect. If you have already, thank you. I wish to thank you for being here now. And take good care of yourself. I'll see you next time I see you. Namaste, Sagis.